Hi everybody, today we're gonna make the um, the Rainbow Daisies. It's a ridiculous name, but it says what it is. So we're gonna make a really neat rainbow background. And the trick is it's texture, right? And so the texture, shape, and color. So the background has no shape, so that one's gone. So it's just texture and color. And the best part about making this painting is not putting a color because nobody cares. Like, oh, a color. Hmm. Right? But giving it permission to have interesting texture. And then three versions of a color. Dark, medium, light. And here's dark yellow, medium yellow, light yellow. Here's dark orange, medium orange, and really light invisible orange. Right? Dark dark red and dark red pieces, medium red pieces, orangey red pieces, right? So we keep doing that. And then who helps us soften the background? Otherwise it'd be dark, white, little decorations of white, 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 white. white. And then the white are little highlights. <laughs> pew, 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 pew. And then we're trying to make good texture. And this is what I always do, and I don't want to, is I make a bunch of X's all the time. And that's not a good texture. Or I go, this is what I did at the end. Look, they're all going in. This isn't wrong. I wish I did it better. But they're all going in the same direction. No, they're supposed to be like random like this. But look at, I ended up all going in the same. I don't know. It's hard to get it to go in the same direction. Or in different directions. Because your brain doesn't want to. Yeah, it's side long. It's long ways. The long ways, not the not the tall way. The long way. This way. Long way is best. Okay, and then what we added this time is these little ladybugs, and those are fingerprints of red. Boop. But not the tip of my finger. That would be a tiny little circle, right? So I use the whole flat, flat part of my finger and I go to smooch and it makes a ladybug. And the ladybug is sometimes just touching. It doesn't have to be on, on it. It just has to be touching it. So sometimes they stick out. They don't have to be on the stick. They're not kind of next to the stick. Okay. So those are our three things. Those are, we do a background. And then these little uh, black things, they're using this paintbrush, the little square paintbrush, but we hold it the up, up straight up and down and use it like a knife. Does that make sense? So see, it's real skinny. I don't have um, the black thing. The little blue one? Look, this is what happens to them is they fall inside your napkins usually. Check in your napkins. Or they fall behind your painting sometimes, like this, and they land inside here, and they hide. Look for them. Oh, see, now it's stuck. <laughs> okay. Did you find it? Yeah, or if you have one of your other paintbrushes from previous paintings, too, you can use that. It's just a little, little, a little skinny one. And then we have the teeny tiny itty bitty pointy one, but she doesn't hold enough paint. So this one will hold more paint so it can go farther, but we hold it the skinny way and put, put, push it up. Okay. So let's do the background first. So we're going to use the big paintbrush. Big, big paintbrush. And then it's brand new which makes it a little bit stiff. So bounce it on your hand and tell it to wake up. Just kind of la, 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 la. Remember, if I can see your painting, you help me be a better teacher because I can walk, follow along and make sure I don't go too fast. Fun, fun, fun. Now it's a little bit wider, a little bit fluffier. It's not as stiff, right? <laughs> okay. So we're gonna start with our, with our, we're gonna start in the middle, right? This, cause while our paintbrush is the cleanest, this this bright yellow area right here first okay so i go all right all right then so i get my um white paint and i need to open it and then yellow do you have a lip you have a little one 
Okay. Yeah, that'll work. That'll work. Okay. Just so it's not a, a big wide stem, it's more of a thin stem. Okay, so we're gonna paint that, and it's right here, it's this middle part. So we're gonna use our hand to measure and open our hand as big as it can. It's basically, we find the middle of the painting. So I'm like, wow, my hand's too small, so maybe I on purpose scooch it, try to find halfway, halfway, I don't know, middle. And then we're gonna put a blob of white paint there. And the paint. I just poked my paint and I just go bloop <laughs> there. But you can't see it, right? <laughs> it's, a, it's a white paint on white here. Let me get a speck of yellow for it. <laughs> I'll decorate it a little bit. And then it show up a little, a little bit more. <laughs> there. You don't put yellow on it. It's just cause you can't see white on white. <laughs> okay, so it's just a white dot. And then it's gonna be as wide as our hand. So I'm gonna get more white stem and just put pokes. Or I'm just gonna use my hand like a big U and I go, oh, so I'm gonna go like, you know, the dots like under my hand. I just kind of go, okay, I guess it's this big. Can you put white uh -huh. uh -huh. It's just white, but I put yellow in mine so you can see it on camera. But it's just white, and it's how as big, big you, the middle of the painting, and I open my hand, and I go around in pokes. This is a nice big you. With the white? With white. Yellow. With white. Okay. Okay. The yellow is just because you can't see it on camera, you know. She's just doing it in yellow for you to be able to see. Okay, and now we get to try our very first time making the texture. We just kind of slap it like this. Psh, 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 psh. So we get more white poke, right? And I want to get inside here all wet with white, but I go like this and I go slap, 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 and then get more white paint. Slap, 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 slap. And then I get more white paint. Slap, 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 slap. Oh, now you do it. We're going to fill it all in. But am I scribbling it? Don't outline your hand, Julia. It's humongous. And go way down lower to the middle of the painting. Lower, 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 middle of the painting. Right? And then open your hand nice and big. There you go. Big. The big piece of yellow. Gigantic. This is going to be the yellow part. Okay, now I'm going to, I, I fill it in. Go ahead, Julia. Go, go, go. Remember, Julia's the only painting I can see, so I'm going to pick on her. <laughs> so, go ahead, Julia. Go, go. And now I'm going to fill it in and just go dash, dash. And now, oh, okay, I have some parts that are dry. You know how I can tell they're dry? They're not shiny. I can see from the light in my room that it, oh, I'll fill that. Let me get more white paint. I'm going to find all the dry parts. I'm making interesting texture. Question? Gage? I didn't understand that one more time. Oh, I'm filling in this middle part with white white paint. This whole middle part that we traced around our hand, I want to make it wet with white. Do you remember when we did the sky and we got it wet with white and then we decorated it? Yeah, we have to get it wet with white so the white will eat up our yellow. So we're going to get this whole middle part wet with white. And we're practicing our texture. Do I rub it in like this? Smooth? No. I slap it in there. I just play with the texture. So we're getting it all wet. Say that again. I think he, 
Okay. You get Okay, so you'll see in the so you gotta get this all wet with white. Your paint's drying. Get it all and how big? I don't know, humongous circle all the way to halfway. And it's touching the top of my painting and it's to here. But it's white on white, so you can't really see it good. You can't I put a little bit of yellow on it, but I put any more, I'm gonna ruin it. And now I'm looking for how, oh, there's miss, still missing shiny parts. I think because my paint's drying now. I'm trying to get it all wet with white. Just get more paint. Stop! Get the paint. And then swish, 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 swish. Like we don't care. We're cartoons. We don't care because we have interesting texture. Remember, it's a little dash. It's a, not a scrub. It's not a scrub. It's like a dash. You know the dash between phone numbers? Dash, dash, dash. Or a minus size, sign. Minus, 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 minus. Like that. So it's interesting. If I scribble, it'll look like zigzags, right? Who got theirs all wet with white? All the way down to halfway. Nice big circle. Okay? So. So Gage, watch me, everybody pause and watch this. Now I'm gonna get my yellow and I stab my yellow. <gasps> I got a lot. You don't have to clean your paintbrush, Gage. I'll always let you know because the paint in your paintbrush actually makes new colors. Okay, now I'm gonna drop it off on the ceiling of that white glob. I just wipe it off and go, ew, bleh. That's how many color values for 3D? Three. That's going to be my darkest yellow, right? That's very yellow. And I still have a good, I still have some on my paintbrush, but it will come off. Okay, you guys ready to play with texture? So everybody pause and look up. Ready? I'm going to show you. I'm going to do it. I'm going to stare at the camera and try to do it backwards, right? So I wanted to have interesting texture, but I'm going to do it in one, two, three, four, five, six, seven rows, I guess. And I'm going to run out of yellow on purpose. And the white's going to eat all my yellow. And I'm going to run out. So I just go, la, 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 weird, 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 weird. Wait, don't go yet. Okay, that's my darkest. Now I'm going to scratch the bottom of that row and try to get it to run out of more yellow. So I just yank on just the bottom of it. And what's in my paintbrush? Right. Oh, look, it's lighter. Now I scratch again. Oh, it's even lighter. Now I go a row beneath that. Hmm, interesting texture. And then I get to the bottom and I've completely run out of yellow. Dark, medium, light, lighter, lightest. On purpose. I don't go back and get more yellow. I like that I'm running out of paint. It's interesting. Don't go up and get more. Try to run out and go run row lower and low. Do I go in straight number one, 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 one? No, boring, boring. I kind of slap it around. And then the next row, right? It's just for play. And go, keep going, Julia. Row after row after row. And then like fake, fake writing. Like fake letters. And then the row beneath that. Fake cursive. And then it's running out and running out. And then the yellow, the yellow's getting all eaten up. But don't get more yellow, right? Because we want to run out of yellow. Nice. Okay. Oh, my edges. My edges are smooth, though. So how did I manage that? I would like ugly edges. Like... You know how a zipper is rough like this? Everybody pause and look up. Here's my zipper and then the other zipper goes like this. Well, when two colors come together, we'd like a new color to happen. So let's make the edge rough so we set up the zipper, right? So I go, all right, let me make some stick outies for the, so to attach to the next color we do. Oh, it's all ratty. And then the ratty the other side. So no straight lines. Just what was in my paintbrush. Rough it up. Okay. What if I have?
have some pure white pieces showing. So, it'll be bright. I don't care. Do I have nice rough edges? Rough, 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 rough sticky outies. Stick, because they're going to grab onto a new color. Okay, now let's put yellow right here. So, it's about, and it's attached. So, I'm going to probably paint over this. But it's a hand bic. Right? Or halfway between my yellow or the what I just made and the side. I cut it in half, you know. So I go, all right, this is going to be yellow. Pure yellow with nothing in it. So I go, all right, I'm going to poke my yellow. Poke! Okay. And so where did I say? I'm just going to put a fake line for, for my brain. Maybe some, okay, I cut it in half. And it's just as low, too. And, the, and that's not real. I'm going to paint over. The, I just want to, you know, know where it goes at. And then put some dots for your brain. So you go, okay, brain. It's kind of halfway between the side and what I already painted. Put it up, right? Now let's turn that into the scratchy, scratchy, scratch. So crazy writing, but in a column. So I go, let me try to have her stuff with her spoop. Now I'm gonna go and just do this inside edge. I'm gonna sneak up closer and closer to my white, right? And pick up your paintbrush, slap him, slap him like this, and then, and then, right? So you pick up your paintbrush. So you get these little pointy flicks. Okay, now I'm gonna touch just this edge, and I go, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna get, I'm gonna sneak up closer, and I go, oh, it's less yellow, but that's all right. Oh, oh, I got closer. I got one row closer. Ooh. Now can I go sneak up another row closer? Don't clean your paintbrush. We like the yellow on our paintbrush. And then I'm going to sneak up oh, even closer. Oh, I'm touching. I'm sewing them together with the zipper. They're touching now. La, 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 la. I they touch, but this and we're rough edges, right? Fluffy edges, so they're they're not no straight lines. It's fluffy, it's fluffy and scratchy, and it has little rough edges. And then maybe with just what's left in my paintbrush, it's almost like dust. Maybe I put one more row. Oh, it's disappearing into my white. Look at disappearing misty. La 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 la. I'm trying not to make X's because usually I just make X X X. It's not cute. Oh, look at look at you can't see it. It just disappeared. It turned into mist. So good, but that's boring. I wish it had some interest. Maybe a little bit of white. So I'm gonna get a little poke of white poke, and just put some little white flicks on my yellow because she's so boring. So I just go flick, 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 flick. But now I don't like it because those look like polka dots. So maybe I could pick up that white and drop it off somewhere else. Like pick, 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 pick it up and put it, pick it up and put it there. Just some, just a little decoration because it was a little harsh, right? Oh, oh, look at, I made pretties. I have, oh wait, I didn't decorate it all the way because how many color values for 3D? Three, dark, medium, white. So do I still have some dark yellow? And then I have some baby yellow happen where it mixes with white and then some invisible, invisible, misty white pieces. Oh, pretty. Who wants to do it again? Another color, right? But now I'm gonna get orange and orange is, I gotta open mine. Orange is so, it's dark like red and it's very aggressive. So I don't need very much orange, even though I gave you a lot. Uh, she's very, very dark. And she will not, you know the disappearing trick? She hates to do that. So you have to put just a little and make her do it, right? So you're like, okay, orange, you calm down. She's so aggressive. So I just get, a dirty paintbrush because the yellow is going to make a pretty yellowy orange. But I just barely poke my yellow just on the end. Hello, hello, poke. But look at it's going to make yellowy orange because my paintbrush is dirty. 
And then I go, all right, I'm going to wipe it off on the very side of my paintbrush. Look at it. It made orangey yellow because my paintbrush was dirty. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. But I hate that because it's all straight. And it, you can tell if you got too tiny of a speck because it didn't really cover. So you just get a speck more. We can get more, but it's so hard to get less. You know what I mean? Okay, now I need to turn that up and down stripe into interesting texture. There. You can say the fake words. It helps. Don't clean your paintbrush. Don't clean your paintbrush. We like that it has different colors in it because it's going to make a new color on our canvas. Okay, now I'm going to do, I'm going to sneak up and do one row closer, one column closer. I just scratch on the edge of this and push it a little bit closer to my yellow. So I go, all right. <gasps> oh, the yellow in my paintbrush came out a little. <gasps> Love it. I'm not even going to fix it. And look at my nice rough edge. How come my edge has to be rough? Because like a zipper. They're going to attach with rough texture. And should I get more orange? No. Calm down, orange. This should have been the dark. This is going to be our darkest. And each time we go further away, it gets lighter. Now, let's sew orange. Just the orange in your paintbrush with the yellow. Oh, 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 oh. Look at, I just, what? I just sewed them together. Look at what it did. With my rough texture. <laughs> and it made what? Orangey yellow. Okay, now, do you still have a teensy bit of orange in your paintbrush? Remember, it's interesting texture. It's all about the texture. I think I have a smidge more. Maybe I go... And like a sunset, drop off some of this invisible misty orange in one more. And I'm going to be kind of slappy about it. I'm just going to be like, oh, oh, I put some orange in my yellow. Done. Look, at, I got a pieces, pieces. They just kind of turn into mist and I don't add more. I give it permission to have a disappearing nothingness to it. And I just, I, let's it, watch, look, everybody pause and look up. Look, I am literally, look, I am dropping some of this in my yellow. And it's so invisible, I can barely see it. Because it's just what's left. It's like, a, like, like blush. There. I just decorated my yellow a little bit. Okay. Now I have to clean my paintbrush, so I have to lick it. No. I'm going to get my my cup. And what to clean your paintbrush, you don't stir like that. You bounce it up and down in the uh, uh, pot like this because it forces the water inside the bristles. So Dallas, I'm going like this and rinsing out my paintbrush, bouncing it up and down, forcing it inside the paintbrush, stirring doesn't really work as good as hop, 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 hop. Cause it's, and then I, I'm gonna push the paintbrush against the side of the cup and squeeze some water out. Now when I rinse it, and I just get a paper towel and squeeze the water out, and a lot of water comes out. It holds way more water than you think. <laughs> there. Oh my God. Correctly dripped on the floor. Okay, and she's mostly clean. That's all we care about. Okay, now we're going to go visit over here. Okay. So we're going to get a, a, a we're going to get green. Oh, put the, put it, get green. Hi, green. Bright green. And do you guys see how big orange is? She's only like four fingers bit big. She stayed near the edge. Right? And now I'm going to get my green with my mediumly clean paintbrush. And I just go poke. Get my green. Just stab it. Stab green. And I drop it off on this side. Whee! Smush. 
And then if it doesn't, you know, and it goes as low as the yellow did, right? Okay, and now I'm gonna do the, make it ratty. <laughs> so I just, cause it's a straight line. No good texture. <laughs> so I go, oh, la la la, 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 you get a lovely owl. Fake language, fake writing. Look at your nice rough edge, right? So it can sew the next color on. And maybe scratch it one row closer to yellow without getting more and giving it permission because we're going to add yellow. We're going to add yellow and make a baby green, right? But first we have to scooch green in one more row. Oh, it's completely dry and see-through. I'm so mad. Do I care? No, <laughs> look it. It's not fair. It's almost no paint at all. I don't care because I'm going to add yellow to it and make yellowy green. See, so it's a little bit dry because it's so thin. But I don't care. I'm going to add yellow. Remember, we don't clean our paintbrush again after we've done the, the orange, okay? That was it. So clean, dry your paintbrush and hurry and do the green part. Stop cleaning your paintbrush. Moving on. I know it's fun to watch the paint, but you're gonna get behind a step. Okay, now I'm gonna get yellow and I just stab my yellow. Stab! <gasps> like this. And we're gonna, where am I gonna put it? Between the yellow and the green? Okay, blah, 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 blah. Right there. It's got green in my paintbrush. I don't care. Just drop it off between the yellow and the green. Whee! Now, now let's uh, make the decorate, right, decorate it. La, 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 la. And put, go walk it into the green and drop some of it off in the green. And it will turn yellow green. Oh, 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 I just, I just dirtied up my green with some yellow. Look what, oh, oh, oh. Now, but remember, it's not a box. Go like this. Look, look, uh, Julia, you can't go side to side. That's scribbling. Pick up your paintbrush and slap it on like that. So it has interesting, yes, interesting texture is so important in this painting. Otherwise, it's a bunch of squares and nobody loves that. Well, that's okay, but what if I put a little bit of white in it? Won't it change it again? Now I'm going to poke my white poke. Okay, Gage, you're not allowed to wash your paintbrush anymore. We don't wash our paintbrushes between colors because the colors in our paintbrush are making new colors we need. Okay? Now dry it all the way. Dry your paintbrush all the way. You can't use a wet paintbrush. So I got my poke of white, and I'm gonna drop it off on that on that down that yellow that I put. Pokey 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 pokey. Remember when we did it on the yellow over here and it made pretty? Let's make pretty over here. So I go pick it up and drop it off. Oh oh what? Whoop chippy pop whoop 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 boom. Well, there's a little bit of misty white left on my paintbrush. Let's go visit green. But she only gets a little, all right? Remember, don't scrub it in, Julia. Drop it off gently. You're, Julia, you're scrubbing it in. Watch, pick up your paintbrush and drop them off like dashes, like little minus signs. Okay, now what's left on my paintbrush gets to visit green. Okay, now I'm just going to get white, poke, and now I'm going to sew the yellow and the green together right here, just with white. So I go, poke, 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 right there with the white and the green. I dropped it off right here. Oh, I'm going to sew them together. So I'm going to scratch the yellowy green and scratch, oh, I'm on top of the yellow world a little bit, but it's just with white paint just with white paint and the dirty little paintbrush, right? My paintbrush is dirty.
Gage, I think you missed the yellow step because you were cleaning your paintbrush, but we put yellow and then green. After the green goes the yellow. There, and now I put that little mist of white and I attached it to my little yellow and it's all invisibly. Woo! You can keep going, Gage. Keep going. Just put a little yellow on it so you can sew it to the other yellow. Put a little yellow on it and make yellowy green right there. Look at, look at what happened where my yellow and my green met. It made yellowy green. Make yellowy green before she touches yellow. Oh, yellow. Yes. Yellowy green meets green. She's not on the green. She's next to the green. Good job. Okay, now we're going to go down the side right here. So now we're going to get blue. Where's blue? Blue. Okay, now I'm going to get blue and I just stab my blue. Stab! I have a dirty green in my paintbrush. Do I care? No. What does green and blue make? Turquoise. I know. Right? So I'm going to drop it off down the side. Smoosh! Oh, look at turquoise happen. Because the green was in my paintbrush. And I didn't clean my paintbrush. Squish! Now, what's in my paint? Whoop! Right? What's in my paintbrush now? Look at your paintbrush. Because you wiped off the blue. So what's left in your paintbrush? Turquoise. So let's go underneath the green. And go, Hel uh, oh, hello turquoise. I'm not touching this blue. I already wiped off the blue. So, oh, there's just a little mist of blue. Uh, oh, turquoise is in my paintbrush. Look, look, Julia, look what I did. I went underneath the colors, right? But wait, look, look, uh, Gage. I am uh, doing it wild and not a straight line. Not a straight line. I am doing it wild. Now you do it. Interesting texture. Well, that is so boring. Doesn't it need a little bit of white for decoration? Because these ones had pieces of white in it. So I'm going to get a little poke of white poke and go dot, 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 dot. Okay, now, do I want to scrub this in like this? <laughs> no. I pick it up. And I drop it off, and I pick it up, and I drop it off. Oh, it's so much lighter with a little bit of white in it. What? It's so pretty. It's so pretty. It's more turquoisey. But nice rough edges. Look at how mine climbed. Look at mine. I don't touch it very often, and I'm real flicky about it. Flick, 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 flick. It's interesting texture. Remember, Julia, did you put some white on it? Put a little bit more white so it acts like so you could push it up higher. No, no, sorry, not Julia. Sorry, I meant Gage. I only have two people I can see. Sorry, Julia. Yours is fine. And just, just soften the top of yours, Julia. So see how it looks like a flag and it looks cut off and it's straight? Can you just make a few ratty little stick-up zippers? Zipper pieces? Oh, people. Yeah. There, yeah. Okay. Now, now I can go down. What's, oh, look what we did. Oh, we traveled, whoosh, underneath. Well, now who's down here? Oh, blue and blue and purple. I don't know, right? Okay, so now I'm going to go, okay, that's not enough blue. I need more blue over here. So I'm going to stab my blue. Stab! No, I'm going to I'm gonna get a scoop. I got a scoop of blue. Right? And I can, I'm not, I don't need to go up here anymore. I like that little edge I did. So I just go, bloop, 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 bloop. And we're probably going to have to stop and get blue sometimes because it's not, gonna, we're going to try to make it to halfway or a little before halfway, but we just go, hello, hello, pick it up and drop it off, and pick it up and drop it off. And look at how I'm staying right here, because what am I also getting out of my paintbrush at the same time? 
that green that's in my paintbrush going like this gets the green out and makes turquoise. So I'm only as big as my hand, but it's kind of turquoisey because there's green in my paintbrush. <laughs> Don't scribble. Don't scribble. Dash, dash, dash. Interesting texture. Oh. It's the texture that's the best, except for making new colors. Who's got a little bit of green in their blue? I know, because it was hiding in your paintbrush. So what if we put a little bit of white on that? What's green, blue, and white? Turquoise. So I'm going to poke my white. I just would like a few uh, highlights of white for decoration. Tap, 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 tap. And then, how do I change her texture? So I like the texture I got up here, right? So it was just pick it up and drop it off and pick it up and drop it, right? So I'm the same, same. Oh, look at it change. Look at it. Ooh, I have highlights. Do you have dark, medium, and light now? We do. Where's, and then nice rough edges. How come? Because the next color is going to sew to that, right? So no squares. Squares are too hard to attach a color to. So I let the edge be ready. Is it turquoisey? Pretty. But now I can go even more blue, right? So most of the green is out, so I get more blue and I'm gonna get a scoop. Now I'm gonna go, all right, basically, let's just put dots for where halfway is. Middle, middle, between halfway between here, the two edges is, I, I don't know, ish. Just for our brain. Cause what's on this side, the red and the blue. So this is just blue. It's going to be blue and purple. All right. So I get more blue and I go, oh, you mean fill this in with some more blue? Oh, I just tapped my green. I wasn't looking. I'm going to clean it out. Let's clean it out. What? Ugh. Should I be mad or just adjust and do better? Now I'm going to have more turquoise than you. You guys are running out of blue, not me. I, I mean, running out of green now. Okay, I got my blue. Let's see what happens. Okay, la 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 blue. La 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 blue la la la. And, and I'm, ooh, and my edge is all rough where they meet because they cross over and scratch at each other. Uh-huh, uh-huh. They're ratty and scratchy where they touch. It's not perfect and straight. No, that would be bad texture. Ooh, scratch. Ooh, look at where it's thick. Where my blue is thick will be darker than where my blue is thin because there's more pigment. So even just giving it different thicknesses of paint makes it 3 d because it will dry darker where it's thicker. Well, that's just blue and boring. I know what it needs, a little bit of white. So, because look at how cute turquoise is over here. If she had a little bit of white, she'd be cuter. So I get a poke of white and I just go Because what's gonna happen to my pokies? Make little highlights. Because how many color values do I want? Blue? Blue and white and little pieces of white. Pick it up and drop it off and pick it up. Pick it up and drop it off and pick it up and drop it off and pick it up. Ooh, ooh, you're jealous of Marina? Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. I just made little highlights and I'm trying not to make X's because that is always my thing. And then I look at it later and go, why did I make so many X's? <laughs> I don't know, it's, like, it's the texture that makes me the happiest. I don't know. And I just need some white. Right? And then don't scribble. It's slap, 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 slap. Look at your texture above and go, oh, how did I make that texture up there? Oh yeah, I wasn't scribbling. I was going flickety flick. Don't get don't get tired and start scribbling. Boring. Okay, what should we put at the very bottom bottom? What's our darkest color? Besides black, not black. Purple. Ooh, it looks almost black. She would dry black if she didn't have a little help, but we have white and blue to help us. Gage, you can't paint up there with a dirty paintbrush. I would just let it rest. 
Okay, now I'm gonna get my purple, because every time I get a new color and I paintbrush, right? So question, Dallas, yeah? What color are you doing? We're gonna get purple. Can you find purple? Open your purple. Yeah, we found it. Okay, so I just stab my purple. And then purple, she, you think she's dark, right? She's actually kind of see-through and shy. So I stab my purple, and if I need to put more, I will. Stab it! And it's wiped. What if you get paint on your easel? Your easel doesn't care. She likes paint. That's what she was created for. So I just wipe it off underneath the blue. What? Blue. Blah. That's very blue, right? But that is the wrong texture. I hate it. It shouldn't be a perfectly straight line. So can you ratty it up and make it interesting texture? Ooh, it makes stripes of purple in it. Ooh, can we go just with the paint that's left in your paintbrush? Do not get more purple. We're just gonna scratch at the row above it and make little blue purple stripes. <gasps> I just made one more row above it. And look at how much lighter she was. Because I didn't get more. I gave her permission to run out of purple. Oh, would you think one more row would be even softer? If I went one row higher? I don't go down and get more purple. Uh -uh. I'm trying to run out of purple. So if I, get one, if I go one row higher, it's just what's left in my paintbrush? Oh, it's like misty, misty purple. Oh, she climbed. Did you get dark, medium, lighter, lighter, lightest of purple? Yeah. I just, it ran out as it went higher, right? Because I didn't get more. I gave myself permission to run out. It's very dark on the bottom, and then it's nothing, nothing, mist, 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 not gone. What's in my paintbrush right now? What perfect color is this? Is this misty, bluish purple right now? Right? So now I'm going to go, oh, just what's, I'm just going to touch the, everybody pause and look up. Stop painting, right? I'm going to touch this glob on the very bottom, bottom, and push it into the corner like an L. Oh, oh, just decker. Oh, okay. I just put it in the corner. I just, I just touched it and walked it into the corner. That's all you get. Like an L. And I don't get more paint. I'm using a misty, dry paintbrush, right? And then, I don't like the edge. See how it's like a, ooh, is that fuzzy? No, I'm gonna get softly and just tell it to turn into invisible mist on the edges. Fuzzy, fuzzy mist. I made an invisible mist on the edge. Just cause I don't want it to come to a sudden stop. Is it still purple? Yeah, but we haven't got any more purple. It's just a dirty paintbrush. It's just, I, and look at where I got my purple. I touched the very bottom of the painting and kind of walked it across like this. And then, so it's just less. I give it permission to be kind of like that, a little dry and invisibly. Who likes making new colors? Me, 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 me. Love it, love it, love it. Okay, now we get to make, make a purpley blue. So now we're gonna stab our purple, stab! And what's in my paintbrush right now? Blue. So the next row should be bluey purple. So I'm just gonna go down next to him, then blue in the middle. Purple, 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 purple. Cause I'm gonna sew this purple to that blue. I dropped it off first. Get off my paintbrush. Right? And then I make it into a ratty scratchy. Look at purpley blue because my paintbrush was dirty. <gasps> I touched the green. I don't even care. And then, oh, they're not quite touching. Can I do one more row and kind of push it into the blue one more row? Oh, oh, scratch, pull, push, 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 push and pull the blue. Push and pull. Oh, oh, they sewed them together right there. Pretty! 
Do you see the invisible edge you're creating? Now let's go along the bottom and put purple because she's like dark, right? So I'm going to get purple and go stab and just wipe it off along the bottom. <laughs> she's not staying purple. We're going to put red on her and make reddish purple, which is awesome. But we have to put the purple first. And then it's a straight line and I hate it has no texture. It's not interesting. So I make it texture. Little bit of I look at my nice ratty edges because what I'm sewing the next color to that. Now I'm going to get red. I have to open my red. I'm so afraid of sitting in my colors cuz it's right here by my table and I'm standing next to them. Now I'm going to get red. And I'm going to put it above the purple. And what's in my paintbrush? A nice, beautiful, filthy, purpley blue color. So with red, it should make a deep reddish purple something. So fun. So I poke my red. I don't need a lot. Who's more aggressive than red, orange, right? So I'm just going to get some red. She's very, very dark. So I just poke my red. Poke, I just need some because I can't get less. But I could get more if I needed it. So I just get one little poke. Just a poke. It's all you need because she's very, very dark. Just some. And then drop her off above purple. Hello. Oh, look at your dirty paintbrush made. Ooh. It's in your paintbrush. Look at it. It's, we just put a pokes of red above our purple so we can scratch them together and make purple. Okay, I'm gonna sew them together. Oh, it's changing colors. Purpley red happened. Yummy, yummy, yummy. Maybe even put some of this what's in my paintbrush down because I love it. I'm gonna put a little bit on that purple. Look at that. Oh, because that's fun. What is this color I love so much? Purpley red. Is this the color of a butterfly or what? Okay, now I have to clean our paintbrush. I know I lied when I said we're only cleaning our paintbrush once because I didn't want you to do it. So now we're just going to clean our paintbrush out. And no, look, look, water. This time, this time it's okay. But we just go... What am I trying to get out? The green. I'm worried the green won't get out. So I can start, look at, oh, it all came out. And then I'm gonna give it a squeezy and then watch out for, I'm gonna touch the side of the cup because a whole bunch of water comes out. It always lands on my floor and make me mad. Squeeze, okay, there. Cause you, what does green and red make? Does anyone know the color wheel? Green and red, when you mix them together, makes brown. So I don't want any. Ugh. Okay. Now, ew, see the brown in the cup? That's disgusting because we have all the colors in there. Ugh. Okay. Now I'm going to get pure red. Red. And now she's not going to have any purple. And she goes up here and she goes, boop, 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 boop. And then what, uh, that's, bleh, right? I, that's boring. So I changed her texture. Stop And I'm not touching the purple yet. I'm going to walk down to purple. Do the nice clean red first. <laughs> oh, I touched the purple over here. Don't care. Should I sew those together now? I'm going to go and scratch that down. <laughs> And then what comes after orange on the on the color wheel? I mean oh, I said it. What comes after red on the color wheel? Orange. Okay, but who's aggressive? Where'd orange go? Oh, she's under my napkin. Where oops, don't throw paint. So I got my orange. Is this aggressive color? Is she, does she try to make a dominant? Yeah, yeah. Is 
just a little. Orange freaks me out how much she wants to cover everybody up. She's very rude. So I just get a little, just some, some orange poke. Okay. And I just put, Wait, you see with the red? yeah, we're going to put it above the red and then make reddish orange, but she, orange is more aggressive than red. You'd be surprised. So I just go la, 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 la. Okay. Calm down. And then what? Sew that orange and red together and see what happens. Oh, what? <gasps> you know what I forgot to do? Add the white down here. That's okay, we can pause. So we need to clean our paintbrush again. Bounce, 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 bounce. Ew, I made brown, brown water. That's disgusting. But it's okay. Pinch. Oh, I just dripped it on my floor. Because I need a little bit of white. Why? These are, look how much cuter this side is with some white in it. And this side we never did. What the? So I'm going to get a little poke of white and put down here by purple. Just a little bit. Pokey, pokey, pokey in the purple world, in the purple world. And then I'm going to clean off the extra white. That's all. I just want a little bit, a little bit. I just want a little bit of white down by purple. And then what do we do? We've only done like 50 times. Tuck, 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 tuck. Pick it up and drop it off. Oh, look at her tail purple. Look, calm down. Nice. And I can even walk it over here in the middly part. Mm -hmm. Oh, she got cuter. Let me walk it down across the bottom. Oh, I want, oh, look at me. Look at the, oh wait. I started going all in the same direction. Remember I told you I do that? Look, at, I got to start making them more like that. All right. I'm making them all in one direction. Okay. And then tiny, tiny poke more white poke. Who does this tiny poke go for? Can you drop her off in red? Oh. And then she would like, oh, she's gonna make like little pieces, soft pieces of, of red. Oh! Look. Oh, 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 oh. Pretty. Texture. It's all about the texture. <laughs> That was a little bit of white to put on our red, so she calms down. She's a little bit dark, just a teensy bit, and then decorate, decorate. And now we need to, who do we have left to sew together? Orange world from the top and red world from the bottom. So I'm going to get a teensy, tiny bit of orange. Poke, and put it, oh, right, right, on where they touch. Orange. And sew them and sew, la, 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 la. Ooh, it's not very much. You know why? You know what I should do to help them sew together? Yellow. Get yellow and make yellowy orange. Now watch, instead of using white, I'm going to put yellow on this orange. And what's she going to make? This color up here. So I go, oh. I just made an orangey yellow, bro. Aw. You know what she needs? A little bit of white. Poke. Because she's not cute. And give her some cute little funsies. Fluff, 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 fluff. Oh, and I... Oh, this little light orange would be cute down in red a little bit. So I'm gonna go visit red because I have a, oh, just a few. Oh, I put a few little, oh, they fell down into red. How cute. Little pieces of, oh, she fell, oh, oh. Okay, now I'm almost sewed together. You know what this needs at the very tip to top? White. So I'm gonna get a little piece of white and then where's the orange gonna come from? My paint brush. So watch, everybody watch. Look, look, everybody look up. Everybody's looking down. Everybody look up. Stop painting, Fatima. Look up. So I'm going to go, oh, so just yellow on the tippy tops. 
and maybe up the side and then sew this together and maybe decorate just a little, a little into the yellowy orange world. Okay, just on the edge. Okay. We went all the way around. No, this color. Oh, and, and Julia, use your dirty, like, sew those together a little bit so there's not a little white stripe there. Scribble, scribble, scribble. Yeah, yeah, sew them together. They'll push and pull together. There you go. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And then, you know, this is, do you know what this is? If we did nothing to this, this is an abstract. What's an abstract painting? Color, shape, and texture, but no subject. There's no object in this picture. It's not about anything. So if you took a picture of this, just like this, this is fine art. This is blocks of interesting colors you could talk about. Isn't that neat? Each one could be a field of different flowers. These could be the sunrise. It can mean anything you want it to mean. You want to see something neat? Watch this. Everybody pause and look up. Look. Still an abstract painting. Still an abstract painting. Still interesting to look at. It has no subject. So you can hang it any way you want and it's still curious to look at. Good job. Okay, now we could put the lid on all of our colors except for uh, orange, white, black, and red. Orange, yeah. So buy blue. Get out of here, blue. And buy purple. Buy red. I like to put the lids on them because I don't want them to dry out on me. And I don't need yellow. But I do need orange. She's going to be the middle of my flowers. And I do need white and black. I don't need green. Buy green. Okay. Getting rid of... I'm moving them all out of my way. and Get out of here purple. Okay. So this is all I need, let me show you. Oh, where's red? I put her away, that was a mistake. Okay, so left, I have, I need red, orange, I'm afraid I'm gonna drop them, white and black. This is all I need left. This is all I need. You can put the lids on everything except for red, orange, yellow, black. Let me show you. Right? So I need black for stems, I need white for flowers, orange for tummies, and red for ladybugs. Right? So we should make the black stems first. And look how far apart they are. They are a hand apart. They don't touch and they're not friends. Okay? There's one, two, three, four. Okay? So I'm going to put them back up. I just wanted you to see that I have four colors. It's all I'm using. Put these back over here. Okay, where's my blick? And where's my little uh, tiniest paintbrush? Where'd she go? Where'd mine go? Oh, there she is. She was under my napkins. There she is. Right? <clears throat> and now I'm going to make, um, and I go from the purple all the way up to the yellow. And are these straight lines? Are these straight lines? No, they're a little swervy curve. They're like S's, long S's. They bend and they're not scared. How do I hold my paintbrush? Look at me, skinny and flat. Look, 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 gauge, very important. It does not go big like this. That'll make a giant line. I turn it like this. So it'll make a skinny line. So look at your paintbrush, skinny line, right? So it's just real thin like this. Not, not like this, that's humongous, I skinny. But I like this paintbrush, she can hold a lot of paint while we travel. And then you might just be, I usually end up painting mine twice. The first one, I usually run out of paint on my way so I just go ahead and let it turn into dust and then I come back and make it darker. But I don't pick up my paintbrush. Do you know why? I pick up my paint and I stop. I go, oh, I ran out of paint. 
I'll never land there nice again. It'll always miss. So I go, oh, okay, let me just try. So we're gonna make the first one and she's a whole hand, a open hand away from the side. Like, oh yeah, so she's in the middle of the red. Oh, whole, my whole hand, yeah. Open hand, yeah. So I'm gonna poke my black book and I stab it because I need a lot. I have far to go, but I hold it straight up and down. It's really hard because my hand has turned it to the, or made it fat before, but I'm gonna try really hard to make it skinny. Okay, do you have a smaller paint, smallest paintbrush we got, right? And I go, it's a whole hand in. I might just put a dot so I know. Okay, a whole hand in would be, um, I guess, um, there. You know, it's like a hand away from the side. Just for my brain, right? So I know where it goes at. Now, I'm, I'm going to go like this. And I, where am I headed to? Yellow. But what do I have to do? Not make a straight line. So I might roller coaster it. Whoa. Everybody watch me. Whoa. 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 Okay. So watch me. I'm going to go up and I lean into the orange and then I lean into yellow and then I spin like a six when I get to yellow. Now you do it. I leaned and I leaned and I'm not straight on purpose. Whoa. Whoa. So I went back and forward on purpose, a long, bendy, not straight. And then I just give it a six on the end, or a G. Let's make one jump from the, uh, go, go ahead, Gage, drive, drive your car, straight, and just drive your car and don't stop, who cares, as soon as you get to the yellow, just go, 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 and then spin, there you go. It's a six. Oh, cuteness. And then what about we jump off from the side right here where red is? Let's make one. Look at mine. Look at what she did. This one snuck on. Oh, she's going to sneak in from the side and jump on and go woohoo when she gets to orange. All right. So I'm down here. I just jump on from the side. I poke my red. And I touch the orange and I go way up in the orange and I go, way. Okay. Oh, 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 she's jumping on. Silly girl. And remember, the tiniest paintbrush we have. Where's your tiniest? And we hold it the skinny way so that it'll be the skinniest. And then can we just make a few little, uh, maybe one little, maybe a little, so look at mine. Watch mine. Everybody pause. <gasps> What if I put a hangy downy little swirl hanging down? Watch me. I just go, oh, another swirl. I gave her a friend. And it's hanging down. And then maybe down here in the red, this one would like her own swirl. So it's like a branch. Hello, I'm another one. Ha! <laughs> I That's straight. Why didn't I curve it? They're cuter when they're curved. You just jump. I should have bended it like a rainbow. Whatever. I don't care. Okay, now I'm going to go, oh, okay. Then in, this, in the middle of the painting-ish, middle, middle of the painting, I'm going to go, all right, I want another one. And she's going to go all the way up into the turquoise. So I poke my blick. And I go, uh, I want her to bend, right? This one, I'm going to make her curve like this. What? So I'm going to go like a big C. Whee! Oh, look it. I missed. Oh, I totally. Oops. I have to draw that again. I must have went too fast. Aw. I, and it's, look how much I bended. I was a little wild. All right. Whatever. Oops. And then I, I'm going to put a butterfly. I'm going to put, I messed up right there. I'm going to put a ladybug right there because I messed up. And then down here on the bottom, she was like a little swirly. Look at, I didn't get a swirly. Great. Now we could put another one. Let's go way over here. And she could go right up the middle. Oh, all the way up into the yellowy part. 
So I'm gonna go, and I'm gonna try to make this one. Whoa, whoa, watch me. I'm gonna go, okay, I'm gonna start over here, and I go, oh, I'm gonna head towards this one. Whoa, and then I turn the other way. Whoa, and then I go. <laughs> I made that, hey, that one's all wavy. And it's tallest, it's the tallest one, it's tallest. Wee, yes. And then, you know what she didn't get? She didn't get any cute little um, curlies of her own. She would like a curly right here. Hello. Oh, because there's a big space right here. So that's a good spot for a curly because there's nothing there. And maybe a little uh, one uh, right way in this teeny tiny corner. I'm a tiny corner. There. Way in the corner. And the big, 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 big corner. And then I feel like I, and now there's a hole right here. So I'll put just another little six uh, in this corner. Okay. Oops, I missed. Picked up my paintbrush there. That's all. Just for interest. So look at mine. Look at my gauge. Look, I have one down here. Right, I have one way down in the corner, a little swirl. She wants a swirl in the corner. And then she wants a swirl and there's a big hole right here. So in the corner and in this hole, she wants one. Yep, because there's a big space right here. There you go. And then really close to the bottom bottom, she's jealous. The very bottom wants one. Good job. Those are gonna be our stems. Okay. Okay, now, now I'm going to uh, use my finger and I'm going to put ladybugs. And I don't need very many, but I need red and my finger. Good job, Inyet. Inyet? Did I say that right? Oh, I missed it. It's frozen. Okay, now I'm going to get my red and that you're, uh, Miss Gill, you're frozen. Okay, now I'm going to do the fingerprint, but not your fingertip. That will make the tiniest speck of a butter, of a, so I have to use the flat part right here. So I make a nice, a big ladybug. So I use my red. Look how much. It's nice and big, right? Whoa. Yeah, so it's, and I go smush. So maybe I put one on this part right here. Smush. And does it have to be on the stick? No, just near the stick. What if they fly away? So you're like, oh, I have to put it on the stick. No, you don't. And maybe one could be way up here and saying hello. Hello from up there. Isn't she cute? And then get more red, because how big is this ladybug? It has a nice big smash. Okay, and then maybe way down here in the red. Oh, she's look how much more red she is because we mixed it with all those other colors. That's red. And then we could put one on, on this one. I guess all the stems would like their very own ladybug, right? And then I can climb here to the right and one near the top. Climb, I'm climbing my stems, but not too many because that's how many we have to decorate. Boring, <laughs> right? So not too many. People get ladybug happy and then you have 50 million you have to decorate. And maybe on this side, like one on this stem, hello. And then in the middle and here and here. So I just, each, each of the curls would like her own, basically. I get one and I get one. Oh yeah, that place where I have, oh, you know what? I'll put a, that thing, I never covered it up with a ladybug I meant to, so I'm gonna put a flower on it. <laughs> okay, just ignore me. So, oh yeah, let me show you. So I just, I think I feel like what I was doing was put, giving each of the curls a ladybug friend nearby 
This curl would like a ladybug friend, and this curl would like a ladybug friend. And we'll decorate those after our flowers, so then we can clean our finger. Where's my napkins? Do you guys know how to make flowers? Okay, it's super easy, right? But there's a difference between making these, see the ends of my flowers? They're round. Do you know why they're round? That's my fingerprint right there. But I push towards the middle, right? So what would happen if I pushed away from the middle? They'd be pointy. Does that make sense? Let me show you. So I'm just gonna put some um, um, white dots you guys get some, clean your finger and get some white on your finger. And let's just put some white dots. Let's just tell the flowers where they live at. All right. So I guess uh, we could put one like uh, one next to the, the butt. I'm starting on this side. I could put one here and one above. We're just telling the flowers where to live. Their bellies. And maybe down down between these two, I could put one there and there and there. Fall down. And there. I went boop, 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 boop. But look at, they're like four fingers apart. They're not friends. Right? They're four. Oh, those are close. Oops. Okay, now I can go down this other side. Maybe falling. Maybe a zigzag pattern, close, far, close. Oh, it makes like a triangle too. And why do we use our finger? It's the only way to make this little round pattern. And now I'm gonna go, oh, maybe above this one and then maybe the zigzag pattern again, down, close, far, close, far. I went close to the stem, far away, close to the stem, far away. But I'm not touching the stems. They float. And we can always add more flowers. I just want a starting place. And then how about this one? Maybe two above, and I'm going to fall down this side. And I go far, close, far, close. And then fall down the other side. Close, far, close, far, close, bottom. We just hopped, right? Zig, zag, zig, zag, zig, zag, zig. And they're about a hand, hand apart, a hand apart, hand. Oh, those two are close. Hand apart. And I'm falling on either side of the stems. Binky, 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 bonk, bonk, bonk. And then if that's not enough flowers, could we add more? Once you put flowers on there, you're going to be like, um, I need a flower here. I need a flower here. We just add more. This is just to start. Okay. And then watch me. Now I'm going to make this flower, but I want to show you the wrong way. So everybody pause what you're doing and watch what I'm doing real quick. You can go back to what you're doing in one second. Watch. This is the not right way. Okay, watch, watch me. Every oh, Gage left. Shoot. Okay, so I'm gonna flick up. Oh, there's Gage. Watch. Don't do this. Away, 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 away. They're all pointy and sharp. So let me show you the right way. I go. I land next to it and I go pull, 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 pull. My fingerprint is the round part. So I go next to the dot and I go pull, pull, pull towards the center. Pull, 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 pull. So I lay on next to it and I pull, 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 pull. Because my fingerprint is round. If I push away, they're pointy. So annoying. But I push towards, then they're roundish. I round. And I just go pull, 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 pull. Oh, the glob in the middle is extra paint. Nice. Pull, pull. So I land next to the dot and pull. Pull in, pull in, pull in. So my little finger. What if the color from underneath shows? Cute built-in shadow. 
pull, pull. Remember, we need all this white. It is a white flower, Julia. You can't make colored flowers because there's already so much color on your painting. Look at mine. What stands out, Julia? Because they're white, they stand out against the dark background. If they're colored, they'll disappear. So what color goes inside the flowers? Orange, okay? If you try to do something different, it's not gonna be as bright. Pull, 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 pull. How many do you have to make before this is easy? Like five of them. After you make five, your brains are like, oh, flowers. So simple. I pull, 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 pull. Oh, that's not enough paint. That's totally see-through. More paint, more white. Pull, 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 little globs. And then you yank on the globs towards the center. And then as soon as you make your flowers, you're gonna see spots that you wish you had more flowers, right? But you can't tell that you need more flowers until you finish your flowers. And you're like, hey, there's a big hole right here that didn't get any pretty white flowers, but you can't see that until they're all made. And then you're like, cause it's called balance. As if the flowers all weighed five pounds and they're on strings and you're like, wait, there needs to be more of them or my whole thing, my whole painting tips over. I need more flowers. I have too many flowers on one side. It's not balanced. Yeah, pull, 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 fun, fun, fun. Decorate, decorate, decorate. And I actually like them when they're see-through and the paint from underneath peeks through. It's kind of cute. What if you get the flower on the stem? So. Wow, I sure put a lot of dots on there. <laughs> That's okay, flowers are fun. Oop, there's another one. Didn't see that one. Okay, now I'm, I finished my flowers. I beat you, you're jealous, but no big deal. Okay, now just keep putting more on there and now I'm gonna stare at it. Now I'm looking for balance and I'm like, you know what? Look at, there's a spot right here, didn't get any. There's a spot right there. Didn't get any. I wish I put some up higher. Now I just put them where I think it'd be cuter. You know, I'm like, you know what? I need, they're just not enough of them. It's cuter with flowers. I'm just going to put more and you just go. You just go. And you're like, you know what? I need a flower right here. And I need a flower. You decide. You're creating balance. And you're like, there's a big hole right here with no flowers on it. So you have to go find the holes. Balance, right? Balance. Like, I need some in the bottom. I need some at the top. I need some in the corners, right? Where else it didn't get any? You have to put more. It, it, the white is creating balance. Like if they were all on strings, would it be balanced, right? Decorate, decorate. The white comes to life and turns on the light. Because look how dark our painting. We put tons of color and white and our paint darkened a lot. So we need to brighten our painting with lots of white flowers. Julia, put more flowers. Look at you be shy about your flowers. Put more flowers. Put them all over. Deck. Look at your yellow and your green world. Doesn't have any. Your orange world is, is, is jealous. Your green world is jealous. Like, I didn't get any flowers over here. And if you have any mistakes you don't like, what should you do? Put a flower on it. Then no one can see it. You're like, oh, I totally hate where I blended right here, flower. Oh, I totally hate where these two colors came together. They totally didn't blend, flower. Like, oh, that place is terrible. Oh, I did a bad job right there. Flower. And then, and then you can even get your orange and put the little orange hearts in their bellies. Watch me, Julia. I'm using my finger. How come? Because my finger is perfectly round and it puts a little orange kiss in their tummy, right in their heart. And they're nice and round. Paintbrushes won't make a round. Poke, poke. Now they 
they look like flowers. Poke. Little orange hearts. Poke, 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 poke. Oh, I missed. That was in the middle. Poke, poke. Do they look cuter with little orange tummies? They look more like flowers. Hey Gage, I didn't show you about the 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 ladybugs yet. Okay, everybody pause and look up. Some people are doing their ladybugs and I just want to show you before you do before you get there cuz some people are like speeding up. Watch me. Okay, so I'm going to make a ladybug. And I get and then how much black do I need? Not not very much. So, I'm going to get the corner where it's very thin, thin black and just get a little baby touch of black, just a tiny touch. And I'm going to cut use this top. Everybody pause and look up even if you're busy. I don't see eyes. Look at me. Look. Oh, thank you. And I'm going to go like this and go scratch right down the middle of my ladybug and make a little skinny black line. So I get my my uh, lady, ladybug and I just cut her in half the skinny way and I go slice. Oh, I pushed hard. I shouldn't have pushed hard. As soft as I can. Slice. 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 Right. I just put one little tiny black line down the center. Slice. Slice. Okay, keep watching. Everybody watch. I'm not going to do more. Now watch. Don't look away. Now I'm going to put a little hat on her. So I just use, now I use the flat way, the big way, and I just go, boop. She has a little hat. It's her head. Boop. 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 Wait. Don't look away. Now watch this. Now I get the stick. Don't they have spots? Now I get to touch the black with my stick and put little dots on them. Dot, 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 dot. More black. Dot, 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 dot. So it's a little slice and a hat and little tiny stick dots. The teeniest, tiniest little red stick dots you can make. Tiny little speckles on their back. Okay, now keep making, go back and finish your flowers if that's what you're working on. Okay, I just wanted to show you that because people are rushing forward. And I give them all little hats. Hat, 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 hat. And then a little slice. Poke, and scratch, scratch, scratch down their back. And the little tiny dots. Dot, 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 dot. Back, back, back. Just not my paintbrush. My paintbrush is too big, so I use my stick for the dots. Ooh, look at yours. That came out so good. <laughs>